Colorado Avalanche fans are not happy right now, and God knows I do not blame them. Alexander Georgiev just put up one of the worst goalie performances in the playoffs that I've seen in some time. Also, I know it's Georgiev, but it's a habit I can't break. And it wasn't like one or two bad goals. It was just consistently bad goaltending that honestly cost the Avalanche a game that they easily should have won, putting up six goals. And they wasted great performances from McKinnon, who was like a demon all over the ice tonight, Makar, and really the rest of the forward group, who put up 46 shots in three regulation periods. Georgiev let up seven goals on 23 shots against. That is horrendous, a 0.696 GAA, and I mean, he's been, let's be frank, bad this season. And as a Rangers fan who saw Georgiev a lot as a backup to Shesterkin, I did not understand Colorado going with Georgiev as a starter. To me, he was quite transparently never good enough, especially for a team with serious Stanley Cup aspirations. There's the idea that when they won in 2022, that goaltending was sort of secondary, and I guess it was, but Kemper was providing something Georgiev just is not here. And right off the bat, I mean, Colorado had their foot down on Winnipeg. The Jets had managed like two shots, they throw one on net, and they tie it up. The 4-3 goal, another one. Sure, it was a two-on-one, he should have had it. Same with the sixth goal. Like, it is a one-timer, but he gets a good look at it. There's no traffic in front. I mean, Money Puck had the game at 2.16 expected goals for the Jets. The Avs outplayed them, and they wasted a six-goal performance against Hellebuck. If the Avalanche get decent goaltending for the rest of the series, I mean, this game one could be forgotten pretty quickly, but if Hellebuck is in form, and this is what we can expect to see out of Georgiev, well, I don't know. They could be bounced. Anyway, just my thoughts on the game. I'm not going to cover each goal. There were like 13 of them, but let me know your thoughts down below.